who do I look like? Over the past year, I've screenshotted every time someone says I look, sound, or act like someone, and I figured eventually I'd do a video on it, and today's that day. I don't know who many people are, so I'm gonna have to Google a lot, but let's get started with Josh, who said, you look like Lil Mosey. I don't really listen to that much music. I'm not gonna know any artists, so. You're also gonna wonder why I'm using Microsoft Edge, and it's because I don't know what's in my Chrome history. It's using Bing, but <laughs> that's fine. When, when we look at physical features, I think we're just gonna see the same two things. Uh, curly hair, that's dark colored and kind of short, and kind of light skin, when you can't really tell what race they are, but there's something that's a little bit white, and that's what little Mosey is, I, I guess, I don't know. Okay, let's move on, that's kind of uninteresting. Uh, so this is where Randall from Recess Bennett. And most of you probably already know who these are, but I'm gonna have to Google them all individually. I have the posture down. <laughs> I'm curious to see a, a clip instead. Boy, Dad, that chicken liver and onion omelet sure smells great. The birthday boy always gets his favorite breakfast. Happy birthday, Randy. Leonard, I'll be home in time. Lee said you look like a young Malcolm Gladwell. I really glad Gladwell. I don't know how I feel about that. Do I? I don't think my face is that rectangular. I'm not feeling it. It's just another curly-headed person with glasses, so why does this guy look like a teenage James Charles? I mean, <laughs> He, he's, isn't he still a teenager? I don't see that. Do you see that? You give off Huey Freeman vibes and that's pretty cool. This would be a lot easier if I actually knew who these people were. <laughs> this is this is a stretch, but let's watch a video, I guess. Eh. Eh. What's eh supposed to mean? Just means eh. Yo, what the deal? <laughs> okay, <laughs> maybe a little bit. He's like that kid from Zombieland. This is the most popular one. I forgot the actor's name. Jesse something. This one's a daily occurrence. I don't know why. I don't know if it's because he was extremely awkward or because he just has curly hair. There's really, he has a pointy chin, but half the population has a pointy chin. I, I don't look like everyone with a pointy chin. I don't, and then the other big one, I don't know if it's on here, but <laughs> everyone says I sound like Blue from Rio. It's the same person, I think. Let me see. Yeah. It... So uh, I don't know if I look like him or sound like him or act like him, but apparently it's one of those and I really don't see any of them, but I guess I'm the only one there because this is by far the most popular comment about my appearance is that I'm literally this bird, but human. Let's hear the voice. Like some, there's a lot of things. Like there are a lot of things. Secretly hiding questions. <laughs> and secretly hiding questions. I don't hear it. I literally don't hear it at all. I don't understand. This was this. This one's obvious. The Emoji Movie. I hyped up the Emoji Movie a lot. I, I never actually watched it. I don't. I'm sure it was a wonderful movie. But one of the characters' names is Alex, and this is Alex. It's it's not me at all. I guess I can't fault it too much. But everyone's name is Alex, so I don't know if it really counts. Moving along. Question, are you the bird from the, the movie Rio? Cause you kind of sound like so the same. I told you it was coming. So moving along. Um, <laughs> I, I, to find all these, I was just going through all my screenshots. This is not, not at all related. I feel bad now. Okay. Um, Lavar's Balls said, dude, you look like Kristen Dunce. Dunce? What? Is this? <laughs> Go Herpin making a cameo in the Vampire Masquerade Bloodlines 2. Love that the guy's getting so much work. <laughs> this one's a little close. I think just because it's animated, there's less features, which means there's more opportunity to imagine my face there. But I'm curious if... I feel so uncultured not knowing any... Like... I literally haven't known a single one of these people so far. Also, another interesting thing is just seeing this person's profile reminded me. I often, like, the my Twitter community is probably the most tight-knit community because I see the same people responding all the time to most tweets. And uh, Brothers was one of those people, and I kind of noticed they just dropped, like, dropped off. They stopped replying. I thought maybe I said something they didn't like. 
And it doesn't, like, it doesn't ruin my life knowing that this one person's not responding. But I was kind of curious if he just stopped liking me or what. Um, so I went to investigate, and uh, this happens like every week. I load your Twitter, and it's suspended. All of, all of my followers are getting suspended, and it's making me sad. And they always do something Twitter doesn't like, and it stop it. But let's keep going. Jerry said, has anyone ever told you you look like the music artist grandson? No, they haven't actually, you're the first person, but let's see if I agree. No, literally nobody would ever think this. Have people never seen curly hair before? It's the only thing is curly hair and maybe slightly larger eyebrows than usual, but those are the only two similarities. No, there's not a single... No, you cover the hair and there's not... No, um, the Snoop Booper said you kind of remind me of Zendaya. This is more accurate than this. I look more like Zendaya than I do the artist grandson. Banana Bogan said, you probably won't see this, but I just want to say you remind me so much of Michael Sarah. I don't know who that is either. I mean, I've heard some of these names, but I don't, I don't look like this. Okay, this one's gonna be hard to find. Um, Killer Robot said, you look like the foster kid from season nine, episode 18 of Blue Bloods. I assume he was just watching and binging the season and then all of a sudden some random character pops up and he's like, that's my man Herpes. I don't know how to find it though. It's on CBS, I don't have CBS. I'm guessing it was a minor character, so someone's gonna just have to send it to me. Unless I just go through this whole list of who looks like me, but we can probably take some guesses. Let's see. His skin is kind of similar to mine, so that means I'm probably him. Or this guy has brown hair, so I'm obviously look like him. He has curly-ish hair, so we're identical twins. There's no others though. <laughs> this, was, this is just another screenshot that made me laugh. I posted someone wearing my cactus merch on Instagram. <laughs> they had a Soviet flag in, in, in the picture. I didn't even pay attention to it. But a lot of people got very upset. And he also called me Apple Herb Keeper for some reason. I don't know how that's related. But people, turns out people don't like the Soviet flag on my Instagram. But honestly, I don't care. You could take a selfie with a Nazi flag. As long as my merch is in it, I'll probably put it on Instagram. What? It's promo. This is, I don't know why the screenshot's in here. I just added it. Um, I screenshotted a guy that found a bow constrictor in his car, so... <laughs> okay, this this is a relevant picture. This is a, a creep shot of me on a rock at a river. Soak it in. Just think about the circumstances here. The, who, someone was just like, a, through the trees, just click. And, and then they sent it to me on Instagram and they said, I think I saw you at, at this river. And I was like, really? I don't think I was there. So I checked the picture and I was like, wait, that is me. It's, it's not me. I don't know who this is, but I, I genuinely thought it was me. It's identical to what I wear. It's jeans, some generic shoes, and a, a blank gray shirt. And I just look sad and annoyed. I can't tell if the hair's curly, but it's the right length. The nose, I don't know if the nose is right, but I, I want to recreate this picture somewhere because I was convinced that this was me even though I knew I was nowhere outside at all for like a week. I don't know who that person is. I, I don't recognize this rock. It's not me, but this is definitely the closest doppelganger anyone has ever sent me and I'm honestly impressed. So good job getting the creep shot. I appreciate it, but it's not me. Not you said I didn't know Dannery, Danneries had a third bro. I don't know how to pronounce anything. Daenerys, Daenerys. What? I know she's from that show people watch. A apparently her brother dies, sorry for the spoiler. What is, what? Is this the right person? I, I doubt there's more than one popular Daenerys, but. Freckles, I don't know. A chin? We, we're not no chin people, the eyebrows? It, well, they said brother, but. What? I don't get it. This is going way worse than I expected because I, I don't agree with any of these except for this one. This is the only one that's not even someone that I look like. It's just me from another dimension. So um, Cameron said, this is the first video I've watched. Uh, one of my first impressions is you look crazy similar to the drag queen Violet Shachi, albeit with a slightly wider nose. Has anyone else seen it? 
Let's see if anyone else sees it. Shocky? <laughs> well, I guess we have to do no makeup. Hey, it's Violet Chachki here. I'm going to be doing a recreation. <sighs> he has eyebrows. I think just the fact that there's a narrow face. Uh, Turan Turtle said, I had a dream Alex was in my town and bought all of his, brought all of his pets. They all lived in my house and so did he, but it was, I'm so bad at reading. Let me try again. Turan Turtle said, I had a dream that Alex was in my town and bought all of his pets. Alex was in my town and brought all of his pets. They, and I had a dream that Alex was in my town brought all of his pets, and they all lived in my house. And so did he, but it was a secret, so nobody in my house knew I had like 50 animals and a human in my room. Also, Alex ate a lot of Fruit Loops. Uh, this is an old, really old comment. This is the first time I had ever screenshotted someone having a dream where I was in the dream. And I, I've found maybe six or seven so far, and normally they're pretty generic. Um, dream, like, just, they're not that weird. I just like this one because I was eating Fruit Loops because dreams are my favorite thing. I'm scared to ask this. Have I ever been in a dream of yours? Don't answer that question. Let's move on. Uh, Harry said, you look like Obama's love child with a camel. I can't really show what this would look like. I think I look closer to a camel than Obama though. This is, um, okay, this is a, a debate topic, everyone. WikiHow, how to pet a turtle. Step one, petting a turtle, approach from the front. If the turtle cannot see you and suddenly your hand appears and make it frighten and bite you with this image. I would bet Stan, sorry Stan, but I would bet Stan that this is me. It's the most egotistical thing I could say, assuming that an article is designed after me. But this is, other than the fact that something's happening here, <laughs> And that could easily be Franklin. I've probably been in this position in a video, and you know wiki how they just screenshot stuff. Like, I'm trying to find examples of wiki how taking stuff, but it all just shows more wiki how articles. Uh, basically, they just take pictures and trace them as far as I know. And I think this is a screenshot of me. Some people have been like, no, nah, there's a lot of curly headed guys that would be petting turtles, but come on. Can you let me live out my dream and assume that I am in a wiki how article, please? Thank you. Next. <laughs> I just, I made this folder a few days ago and I forgot these random things I put in here. It was on my Discord server. Someone named Sammy said, I've given up all my animals except my noble McCall. I'm so sorry for all the drama I've caused throughout the months. The reason why I gave my animals up is because I couldn't take you and I would always get with you guys. I gave my water dragon to my friends. So they're in a better place. I'm sorry if I hurt your feelings. Meaningful. He was apologetic, he had some animal care issues, he admitted them, he fixed them, and then he got an oof, 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 and an oof. Four oofs in a row is a lot of oofs. The Discord server, what a time, I don't... Okay, I asked a couple... I... I... I, I, I don't think I can show the screenshot. I don't remember the context of it, but it's a, a rainbow flag with a certain symbol in front of it, and... <laughs> Brian Bartek, <laughs> and it got me to level one on the server. I'm the only person on earth that finds this funny. <laughs> Tyler said he sounds so much like Jesse Eisenberg. Wow, no one's ever said that before. Just kidding, that's the only ones people agree on. You look like Zero from Holes. This is actually a lot closer. I think as a kid, this because I had longer, like my hair kind of went to here when I was in like second to fourth grade, I would say this is not too far. He's darker than me, but similar face shape that, okay, well, we developed a little differently, but it's on in here, I can see it. I can, I would say we were maybe cousins or something, but like from my younger pictures, but still not super close, but. I am okay with that one. I don't know who that is though, but <laughs> another Discord screenshot. Uh, someone was getting bullied on my server. Of course, they tagged the owner for help, and I don't remember saying this, but this is what I said. Okay, moving on. He sounds like Jesse. Wow, holy heck. <laughs> I think this is the last Discord screenshot. I was running out of 
fake things of who I look like and um, so I had two servers. The second one was more like less family friendly and um, I got tired of the server just because I didn't want to have to run two. So I'm trying to figure out how to explain this. So basically I was going to delete the server, but then some random member was like, I'll take it, I'll take it over, I can run a server, I promise. I was like, all right, I transferred ownership to them, um, and I randomly check the announcements, and one day a new rule was, due to complaints, please refrain from posting bestiality. Thank you. And this single screenshot just sums up my entire experience running an online community. Just everything, I, I love the screenshot. We've got good grammar. It says due to complaints. It's very respectful. It's very professional. It's like something in a big organization would send out to their employees or their community or something. The second part is the fact that it was due to complaints. There were no problems until it was there were some complaints. And the third is just the fact that they're calm and they thank you at the end. And um, anyway, they had a mental breakdown and deleted the server. Um, Morel said, anyone who saw Detective Pikachu, don't you think Tim looks kind of like, looks just like Alex, I mean. Um, the first thing I noticed when I started watching the movie was, whoa, that looks like Goherping. I was very confused that day. I have not watched Detective Pikachu. Detective. Who do we got? No. Why were you confused? You're weird. That's not even close. Okay, I lied. There's another Discord screenshot. I hate my life. I'm always stressed. I want to get another lizard, but I don't believe I have the skills. I hate myself. I'm a bisexual pervert, and I'm gonna die alone. We had a we had a, a wide variety of users. Some people were there for serious stuff. Some people were there just for fun. But this was in my screenshots folder, and I'm showing it. And the first response, and the only response this person got to their very sad message is a reaction emoji on my face. <laughs> Danny from Game Grumps. This is the only person I've known on the list, and I don't even watch Game Grumps. I already know I don't look like him, but um, I think he just has an afro. Yeah, he doesn't even have an afro. That's, that's just long hair. No. Mm, no, it's not. <laughs> this is a wreck. Um, a year ago, when I started screenshotting all these, I thought this would actually be a funny video. <sighs> I made you yawn. Um, it was, it was pretty lame. So, that's everyone that I look like, according to my YouTube comments. Who else do I look like? Let me know in this video. That, that's all I got. There's some others, like, um, people say my style is very similar to, uh, Michael... Michael... Stevens. No, Michael... What is his name? Michael Reeves. Um, I've, I've only watched him for a couple years, or a couple months, um, and it is kind of weird. Our styles, especially editing, are pretty similar, except I'm like a ten, tenth of the size of this channel. But, uh, I mean, we have a... I think our only similarities aren't at all physical, it's just the fact that we're both really annoying, really short, and have a really weird editing style. But uh, those those are all the ones that I've got, so that's that. I'm not in the mood to film a reptile video today, so this is what you got. But technically it's a reptile video, so I can still mark it as pets and animals, because Stan is right here. Uh, wishing he wasn't. And... Yeah, bye.